I think Cape Town is going through an absolute renaissance right now, particularly from a creative standpoint. And you see this blossoming, whether it comes through in architecture, or fashion, or craft, or design, or cuisine. And it's absolutely amazing. And then I think the most important aspect is that South Africans have got this newfound confidence. Here we were uh, absolutely driven apart during apartheid. All started to come together in 1994, a very progressive constitution. And all of us have just got comfortable with each other. And more importantly, this constitution and this framework has given us an opportunity to go and find out about who we are and from whence we've come. So we're not trying to out London London or out Milan Milan. We are telling our own stories. Historically, the city was completely dependent on its natural assets. Table Mountain, Kirstenbosch Gardens, Cape Point, the wine route. I think increasingly we're starting to realize that it's about culture and it's about the people, which is the biggest asset. And we're starting to celebrate the produce of our people, whether it's through fashion, whether it's through craft, whether it's through food, whether it's through wines, etc. We're starting to really widen the scope uh, of the product offering of the city. And so it's not just about the big five, and it's not just about nature, it's not just about the shot of Table Mountain, but more and more, it's about the human dynamic and this interesting mix of cultures that we have here and uh, what uh, contemporary uh, South Africans are producing. Listen, I love innovation and I love to celebrate innovation and I think one of the best innovations with Nespresso, uh, I'm not quite sure it was uh, initially uh, conceived by them but certainly mastered by uh, Nespresso, is the whole idea of uh, a new distribution mechanism with the pods and the capsules, which I think uh, makes for ease of use and super efficient. And I think the, the typology of a coffee machine has changed such that you can have a little desktop uh, proposition and you can replicate what the finest baristas will be doing for you at a store in Milan and I can get that uh, on my desktop at my office in Cape Town. So I think it's just brought this universal uh, appreciation of, of the craft of, of, of good coffee making. And um, I think you know, that's fascinating. So uh, I, I love innovation. I love the fact that there's always something uh, where you could take a very old process that you thought we knew and redefine it yet again. And, uh, and, and that's, that's progress.